Okay. Next thing we're going to do is these are the ends of the connectors that we just connected up to the to the to the thing, the red and the black. These are the ends of the connectors that go to those. Okay, there's these two sharp needle type things that you use to uh, probe your electricity with. Okay, what we need to do is we're we're going to go back. Here's the the uh, the buck converter, and here's the uh, the JST connectors uh, plugged into each other. The JST connectors plugged into each other, and here's the two ends of the JST connectors. The two ends of the JST connectors that we just stripped a couple minutes ago. Okay, what we're going to do is we're going to wrap the positive, the red one, around the red one, <laughs> around the positive. Let's see, can I, let's see if we can, oh, okay, we're kind of focused. Yeah, you, you can kind of see the wire. I'm going to wrap it around uh, this thing. Let me take this and put it down there. And then, uh, then kind of wrap that around there. Okay, it's wrapped around, so we're trying to make sure we get a good connection there. <clears throat> okay, now we've got our negative one. Let's see if we can see if we can focus. No, we're not going to focus. Okay, so we we take the uh, negative one, which is the which is the black wire from the JST connector, and we're going to. We're going to wrap that around the negative, the black one, the black needle thing. Okay, now we're going to take these two and put them off somewhere off camera, but make sure that they don't touch each other. Okay, all right. Now we're back to this thing, the, uh, the buck converter. It'd be really nice. It'd be really nice if my... Oh, oh, we focused. Okay, we focused. Okay. Okay. Uh, my damn... My damn thing came off the back of the... The board again. Whatever. We're gonna... We're gonna heat shrink around this. So that's gonna stay there no matter what anyways. Okay. Now, uh, you guys remember this round thing right here. And here's my screwdriver. This round thing right here, can you kind of see it maybe? The round thing right there. <clears throat> uh, we're gonna we're gonna turn that right or left with our with our small screwdriver. Okay, and while we're turning that right or left, we're going to be watching our uh, our meter. Uh, and when it goes when it goes down to 3.00 volts then once it's at about three or maybe a little bit above three but close to three so three point something something three point zero zero three point zero something okay okay so uh, we've got our We got our things right here with our wires on them. We're making sure that they're not touching each other. And they're not touching any other electronics. Now, we're gonna turn on our switch. We're gonna turn on our switch. And when we turn on our switch, and uh, we got our battery connected to the, to the thing, when we turn on our switch, it's going to uh, say some voltage on here. Okay, turning on the switch. Okay, it says 8.16 volts. Mal Mal Kitty. Love you, sweet baby kitty. Okay, it says 8.16 volts. Now, I'm going to take this, and I'm going to go to the round thing, and I'm going to spin that. I'm spinning it to the right. Nope, okay, spinning it to the right doesn't work. Okay, I'm going to spin it. Oh, spinning to the left works. Okay, now I'm going to go back up to where it was. Okay, and I'm going to show you guys this. It says 8.15. Okay, 
So I got my screwdriver inside there. And I'm spinning to the right, which is clockwise. And I'm going to spin until it goes down to 3 volts or close to 3 volts. 3.2, 3 3.0, .2, 3 .0, oop, 2.62. Uh, spin back to the left, bring it up to 3 volts, just a little bit above 3 volts. Okay, there's 3.07 volts. Great, awesome. That's, that's what do we need right there. So I spun this until we got to 3.07 volts. So I spun this thing right here. I spun it to the I spun it to the right clockwise so it gets to like 3.07 volts. If it's like 3.1 volt, you know, that's kind of okay, but you know, try to keep it between 3 and 3.00 and 3.1. Okay? Okay. All right. Now uh be right back. Okay, now I've uh, disconnected our sharp uh, probe uh, things uh, from the circuit. <clears throat> I've turned off the switch. I've turned off the main switch, so the main switch is off. And you see that it's out, so that means that it's off. If it's in, it's on. If it's out, it's off. <clears throat> okay, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take our JST connectors and I'm gonna unplug them and there's the male JST connector that's still connected to the buck converter focus focus okay it's focused okay so uh, now I've unplugged it so there's just the male JST connector and the male JST connector has you can kind of see there's two holes in the male JST connector in the front and you can see these two shiny things but uh, there's two holes and what we're going to do with those two holes, now that we've turned our uh, our uh, buck converter down to three volts, is uh, okay. There's the red side. There's the red side and the black side. So I'm going to plug in my uh, my little laser to the red. Goes in the hole with the red. See if we can get that in there. Get that in there. Oh, okay. I'm gonna see if I can get that in there. Uh, actually, I'm gonna bend it over a little bit. So I make sure that it's, I'm gonna bend it over a little bit. See, I can. I kind of bent it over the red wire, bent it over, and then I'm going to stick it in the hole with the, the on the red side. No, that's not working. Okay, going to straighten it back out again. So, or, well, okay, it's kind of an angle. Okay, still going to stick it in the hole with the red side. Okay, and I'm gonna blue stick the blue one in the hole with the black side. Bend that a little bit so it's kind of at an angle. And actually, yeah, now we're gonna turn the now we're gonna turn the switch on. I turned the switch on and now my laser is on. You see that? It's uh, connected to the to the connections in the uh, male JST connector red on the red side blue on the on the black side okay and now what you're supposed to do is you look at your you look at your laser dot right uh, the best thing to do is to actually if you can aim it at a building uh, that's okay for you to aim it at that nobody freaks out and um, these lasers are actually made you see it's you know like this main body piece up here and then it gets small right here and then there's like the PC board and the back half well this front half of the laser actually you can take it and you can turn it and adjust it to make sure that it's a nice little point at a long distance away 
once again it's best if you aim it at a uh, building far away uh, you know to be able to see what the dot looks like and then try to adjust the dot you know to that uh, you know if you want to but these uh, these come these come pretty these come pre-adjusted uh, so that they're uh, dot somewhat okay next thing we're going to do is we're going to disconnect our battery and uh, once again remember we have our switch and our switch is out which means it's off if it's in it's on if it's out it's off all right so remember our switch is off okay battery take that put it somewhere else so it's, uh, it's safe and not connecting to anything or catching on fire okay now our uh our uh, thing here okay uh let me see where is there it is uh we need the big black uh uh thing uh shrink tubing shrink tubing okay and you see i can open it up right and it's bigger than the it's bigger than the 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 uh the regulator god i'm really bad at uh, saying words i'm sorry guys uh, the butt converter. Okay, so it's a little bit bigger than the butt converter, whatever. Make sure that it fits on uh, with your glue blob in the back. Okay, so we're going to take it and put it on uh, the uh, male JST connector. We're going to feed it through. Make sure that uh, your thing on the back is able to slip through. Oh, damn. I forgot one special one <laughs> the reason why we had the the marker okay what we're going to do is we're going to take our JST connector put it on the back okay we're going to put our um, uh, shrink tubing right behind our right behind our uh, butt converter and uh, we're going to try to get it <clears throat> right in the middle uh, behind the butt converter and then we're going to take our uh, our marker and we're gonna mark the wires just outside of where the you know just a little bit further than you know the uh, the shrink tubing is okay so I'm gonna mark over here on these wires too about at that point okay about there and this is so that when we put it on when we put the shrink tubing on we'll try to put it between those two marks so it'll be nice and um, uh, centered. Okay, so I'm gonna take that and put it on there. And bring it back over here. Put it back on, make sure that my wire thing on the back fits inside there. Okay, and I'm gonna push it till it gets to the black mark. And I see the black mark over here on this other wire. All right, now we're ready to uh, now we're ready to now we're ready to shrink the shrink tubing. friends my friends online are talking to me okay okay and we're gonna take this and flip it over so that we can shrink to shrink it on the other side okay 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 working out working out working out working out okay getting it going going nice good okay okay now we're nice and we're nice and shrunk uh, I gotta turn off my camera Okay, sorry. We'll we'll we'll, we'll convene in the next video. Bye.